Guys, we're going to be looking at box and whisker plots today. Uh, you will need a ruler um, to complete these so you, because they do need to be nice and precise and straight. Um, I've got some data there. I don't know if you can see that, but I've got 2, 4, 4, 5, 7, 9, 9, and 10. Now, a box and whisker plot, all you need to do uh, to create one of these is to know your median. Okay, um, so you can find the median of a set of data, and then you need to find the median of the lower set and the median of the upper set as well, and they're called quartiles. So let's have a look at this data. Um, I can see there are an even amount of numbers here, so I'm going to put uh, my first median down here. It's between five and seven, which I know the number between those is six. So that's gonna be my first median. Then we're looking at this lower set of data. And we need to find the median of this lower set. It's obviously in between these two numbers, and that would be four. Then look at the upper set, and I've got the median of nine. The other important uh, information to get is also the highest number and the lowest number, because these, these are our whiskers. So two and 10 are going to be our whiskers. All right, so once you've kind of looked at the data and found out your medians, you want to create a uh, number line. So our number line, we can see the numbers go from zero to 10. So I'm just gonna create a nice 10 centimeter number line here, down below. 10 is our highest value and zero is our lowest. And you should be able to try to figure out um, where all the other numbers go as well. So our first uh, median is six. So what you're gonna do is just draw a line a couple of centimeters above. You don't wanna to be too close to your number line. Nice line there and that's six and that's our median. Okay, we're gonna create the box, this is what we're doing. Uh, the next uh, lower quartile median is four. So I'm gonna put another line there, you can use a ruler or nice and straight and our upper quartile is nine so we've got those three lines there and now we're going to box them up so we're going to rule a nice box there so we have our box now our whiskers as we said before are our lowest value and our highest value so i'm going to put a little dot on 10 and a little dot on two there and I'm going to join those up to the middle of the box there so you can see that is our box and whisker plot all right I'm going to draw through another example for you now um, try to follow along